I'm going to show you how to use the corner tool to create a fun icon or logo. Here I have some shapes and I've added them together to create a compound shape for a conical flask. Creating a compound shape is a non-destructive process so the shapes within can be modified at any time. I've also got a separate triangle in the middle to act as the liquid. I'm going to select the corner tool and the node of the corner that I want to manipulate. I can type in a numerical value on the context toolbar or drag the node and place it manually. I can also change the type of corner on the context toolbar. For this, I think a straight corner works well. I can change multiple corners simultaneously, even if they are parts of different shapes. To do this, I'm going to select both shapes in the Layers panel by holding Command on a Mac or Control on Windows and clicking each layer. Then, with the corner tool selected, I'll click drag across the corners and pull them in. I can also change all the corners of a single shape, even within a compound shape. Again, I'll select it in the Layers panel and click drag across with the corner tool and pull them in together. This keeps the corners even. Next, I'll make a label for the flask. Selecting the rectangle tool, I'll drag out a small rectangle and change the colour to an off-white. I'll use V to select the Move tool and enable snapping on the toolbar. And now I can reposition the label so it's centre aligned. I can use C to access my corner tool quickly and drag across the corners to select them. I'm going to add a small radius to the corners and experiment with the other corner types to see which one looks best. I think the concave corner is working well here. So that's it. A quick look at the corner tool. Thanks for watching.